Hi, this is Teague from Service Bro, and uh, today in this video I'm going to show you how to make a simple crossover for your speakers. Now, before we get started, I'm going to show you um, how this speaker sounds without the crossover that we're going to install. And you're going to hear how much bass the speaker has. Yes, indeed! Yes, indeed. It's the Mix it's King! The mix King. Run. So, right there, you heard there's a lot of a lot of bass, too much bass for the small speaker. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna install this capacitor right here, which is 68 uf and is 100 volt, in line with the positive speaker wire. So let me disconnect that. Connect that to that. Chicago, Atlanta, Atlanta, DC, Detroit, New Orleans. Yeah, know the deal. Can hear that it's quite a bit less bass. This is without the capacitor. So as you can hear, that's quite a bit less. Just to show you again, real quick. This is with the capacitor. Follow me, tell me if you feel me. I think niggas is trying to get And this is without it. So it eliminates quite a bit of the bass. Now, if that's still too much bass for your speaker, you can drop down to a smaller number. This one I have is 6.8. I don't know if you can see that because of the glare. This one's 6.8 UF and it's 100 volt. Do the same thing. Put it in line with the positive. As you hear, it took out quite a bit more of the bass. Just to show you again. A lot of bass, no bass. And all I'm basically doing is putting an inline capacitor to the positive speaker wire. Alright, and um, very simple. Um, the capacitors are uh, pretty cheap. You can get them at uh, Radio Shack or you can order them online. Radio Shack, I think, charges you, you know quite a bit more money for them but um we got mine on uh parts express which i think they were under a buck a piece um depending on um the size of them but uh like i said um for your smaller speakers that you don't want bass to go through and blow your speaker or distort the sound uh it's a very uh cheap way of uh creating a crossover Alright, hopefully this helps some people, and uh, please visit my website, servicebro.com.